first, we are in the presence of royalty today. So Princess Soma Noradam of the Cambodian Royal House of Noradam has an incredible story of rebellion and bravery and love and it's brought her here to the Central Valley. So here with me now is Princess Soma Noradam. Am I saying it the right yeah, way? Yeah, you did. You did. Noradam. Yeah, Noradam. Okay. That's right. Noradam. <laughs> so you came to live here from Cambodia when you were little and it sort of, it brought you to Fresno State. It brought you back to Cambodia mm -hmm. and then it brought you back to California. So yeah. first, let's talk about yeah. what it was like to grow up in California. California as a oh. Cambodian royalty. Well, first, well, as being a first refugee and coming to California, you can't really say you're royalty. And right. Running around like you're princess because they might think that you're crazy. <laughs> so it wasn't until 2010 when I was able to um, go back to my homeland, uh -huh. fulfill my father's dying wish because he was dying. And that's when I claim my tie as a princess. So now I'm Princess Soma. Yes. <laughs> yes. So I, I, I was yeah. looking at pictures of yeah. you today in Cambodia and sort of reading about uh, the work that you did there. And you, you were a columnist. Yes. And you were a very brave journalist over there. Yes. And that's kind of what brought you back to the States and brought you back mm -hmm. to California. So what is the work that you're doing here in the States now? Well. When you read my first book, which is called Royal Rebel, uh -huh. that's still on Amazon, that actually talks about um, being a columnist and being accused of incitement. So I can't tell you the rest of it. Right. You have to read it. But then I was able to come back to the States, and I decided just to, you know, help the community. And it wasn't until last year I moved back to Fresno, because my best friend lives here and a lot of my friends from college. And also my second book, which will be launched next month, uh -huh. called Royal Love. It's a sequel yes. to Royal Rebel. It actually talks about the accident which happened here in Fresno. Okay. And that's when my fiancé and I were in a car accident five years ago uh -huh. on Memorial Day. We, we met at Fresno State. We worked together at Pelco. We fell in love in Fresno, and the accident happened in Fresno. So it was kind of a, a complete, complete 360. Yeah. So now I'm able to come back, and I'm helping the community um, healing process because I do have PTSD because yeah. of the accident, but also helping a lot with the Southeast Asian community, uh -huh. um, especially the Cambodian night market. Um, I'm also uh, a part of the exhibit at the New Chaffee Zoo for oh. the Kingdom of Asia. Oh, that's right. Oh, yeah, you and I were talking <gasps> yes, about that last time I saw it. you. Yes, you have yes. to see that. It's going to be big. It's opening in the spring of yeah. this year. So I'm so excited for you guys to check it out. Yeah, everybody's really excited yes. about mm -hmm. that. It's you And you've also got um, a Pay It Forward campaign going on. Yes. So what, what's that about? Okay, so Fresno State, I'm such a big supporter of them, and they're also supportive of me. It's called the Pay It Forward program. And I'll be their guest speaker. It'll be the second time. Um, the first time was during COVID, and I was living in Atlanta, so we did it online. Uh -huh. But it's not the same when you're in person, yes. live, and you get to have a free lunch. Right. So it's the community <laughs> leaders getting together with the students, yeah. and it's going to be at the new student union in the ballroom. But you have to register because okay. seats are limited. They'll provide you lunch, but they also want to make sure that there's enough seating. Yes. So I'll be speaking and also have my book signing. So my book. Royal Love will be launched that day. Okay. And I'll be signing the book. That'll be You've a great come. day. Okay, so people can register. Yes. We'll put the link on our website um, after the show. You can we can rewatch the segment and you can register there. But if they want to register right now, they're they're watching yes. this. Uh, how yes. do they do that? They can go onto the website of the Lyle Center for Innovation and Entrepreneurship. Okay. And just click under community, and then after community, there's a, a link for Pay It Forward. Perfect. And I'm going to be the only speaker this semester, so I'm so excited. And the host is Mindy Laval. So <laughs> so uh, you have a of such an incredible, unique story. So when you do speaking events like this, wh what do you draw on in your life? Because you, you know, you're an author, you're gonna release this book, but that's only one part of it. So how do you put together a, a, a speech like this? I, I do get nervous. I don't even look at the audience, I'll be honest. <laughs> I don't know what you do, but I'll just speak with you know, the host. Like I said, it's gonna yeah. be Mindy Laval. Okay. And we're just gonna talk like, we're just old friends yeah. and we haven't seen each other. And once in a while, I look at the audience. Uh -huh. But you know, like I said, they're expected to have a lot of people that day. The Pay It For program is a successful program yeah. because it helps business leaders get together with the students and give them advice. Right, right. And so you have many topics that, that you can talk about. I mean, you could talk about uh, being a princess. rebellion. You could <laughs> yeah. talk about being a princess, which I would love to hear about. You could talk about writing. You can talk about your experiences with PTSD mm -hmm. and, and trauma. And so I think this will be a, this will be a 
great day for people to sort of hear from uh, yeah. royalty yes. that we, you know, we, right. I don't mean very many royals. Yeah. So we will have all the information if you want to see Princess Soma Narodam uh, in person at Fresno State, you can do that. We'll have the link. Yeah. I'm so, am I supposed to you refer know. to you as uh, Your <laughs> Highness? Um, yes, that's my title now. <laughs> yes, that is your title. It's either yeah, Her Highness or Your Highness yes, or Your Highness. Yes. Thank you so much for Thank being here today. Thank you for having today. me, Emily. And we got to go back to the barbecue competition. That's oh, how we met. Oh, yeah, that's how we yeah. met. We yeah. met at a barbecue. Uh, thanks to AJ Fox. We, oh, yeah, thanks to AJ Fox. <laughs> we were judging barbecue that day. Yeah. I'm still digesting. Yeah. Thank you so much Thank for being for here me. today. Yeah. Coming up here, if the weather has you thinking you need a truck, then stick around. We visit the truck lot at Elite Auto in Visalia. That's next.